All right, we're here at 14,115 feet with James Clay at the 101st running of the Broadmoor Pikes Peak International Hill Climb. James, you've been here before, but it feels like when I say those words, it lands for you a little bit differently. What was this drive like? Uh, this drive was amazing, and this is the best run up the hill, not only because we're in the best car that I've ever had up here. Uh, we refined this thing third year in this car, fifth year overall. So the car just worked awesome, but the weather is amazing. The the environment down, downward in the uh, you know in the pits, it's just electric this morning. This this event keeps getting bigger and bigger, and you know of course Optima batteries with that big presence and. They're, they're a core sponsor to what we do, and I, I, you know, it just feels like home being down there. So being at the top and in weather conditions like this and you know, just having the honor to drive this Bimmer World machine, what an amazing day. Now you say that it feels like home, but I've got to imagine there's a lot of emotion sitting on that start line. What does it feel like to be a driver in the Pike Peak Hill Climb, be as high up in the qualifying as you are, and knowing that it's your turn to take this track? It's intense. There's, there's, there's no other word. It, it, it's absolutely intense. You know, for me, the whole morning is just trying to keep nerves at a, at a base level because it's, you know, when I, when I'm ready to go, when, it, when I roll up to that line, it's not just the car that's off the rev limiter. So, uh, but amazing. Seeing, seeing the team around, seeing the Optima guys, Cam from Optima waved the green flag for me. So that was amazing. And of course, just knowing all the people back at home are watching all our fans, and the, yeah, it feels so good. So as, once you get into the run, you start to control those emotions. What did this run feel like to you? How was your grip? What was the experience of driving the hill like? It was great. You know, we we were on some Hoosier tires that are prototypes for the mountain. They're they're, they're going to turn that into a customer program. So we've had amazing grip all all year, all all month, I guess. Um, so the grip felt great. Uh, the car felt great. The track was a little dirty, you know, so it had to leave a little room for air because you don't know where that dirt's going to come in. Um, but, you know, I settled in quickly. Uh, I, had a, I had an amazing qualifying in the bottom section. Just felt like qualifying all over again, and I was, I was matching that pace. And then middle and top, you know, I only pushed those super hard on race day and pushed them super hard today and feel really good about it. You mentioned your fans watching at home. Talk about the folks that got up at 1 in the morning, that came here last night, that slept out in, in sub-freezing conditions. What does it mean to you as a driver to have them standing on the hill cheering you on as you go up? You know, it's, it's amazing. And you know, to have this 12.42 miles just with people lined all the way. Yeah, I, I say fans at home, and certainly I appreciate all the people that I know that tune tune in to do this, but the people that make the pilgrimage here, the people that are on the mountain, the people that are dealing with, the, you know, it's 40 degrees down there uh, overnight, and it's, you know, we've got some sun, but it's still it's still pretty cold. They're out there, they're camping, they're making the night of it, the day of it. Uh, they're pretty hardcore, and it's amazing. It, it, the fans make the event. I wasn't here in the COVID year when we didn't have fans, and I'm okay with that, because having the fans reaching out, looking out over, the, you know, when I'm making, you know, going through ski area, and those guys are, are out as, far, as close as they can be, just electric, amazing feel, amazing. You can see how much it means to you in your eyes. Congratulations, another trip to the top. Absolutely, thanks, thank you.